In this video, we will show you how to replace your spark plugs on this Kia Forte with a 2.4 liter engine. You'll have four of these located across the top of your engine. Let's get into it. Okay friends, let's get started on our job. The first thing we'll have to do is remove our top engine cover. This comes off fairly easily. You just have to give it a little tug along all four corners. A quick inspection and we'll set that aside. With that cover out of the way, we have a clear view of our ignition coils making their way across the top of the engine. Let's start disconnecting the electrical connector for the ignition coil. For this, you're going to find that you have a gray locking tab. Once you dislodge that with a small screwdriver or pick, you should be able to squeeze on the lock and pull that out of place. A quick inspection for corrosion, set it aside. Next, we'll make our way to the 10 millimeter mounting bolt. You can see it right over here in the corner. Let's remove that. Take hold of the ignition coil, give it a little twist and lift it up and out of place. A quick inspection, set it aside. Once you've removed the ignition coil, it's important to make sure you remember exactly where each one of them goes. So during the installation process, we reinstall them into the same cylinder where we had removed them. With the ignition coil out of the way, the next thing you need to do is have a quick look down in this port. This is where the spark plug will be located. The reason why we're looking in here is to make sure there's no oil or debris. If there's oil, your valve cover gasket's leaking and it needs to be replaced. To remove the spark plug, you want to have a 5 8 spark plug socket. The spark plug socket will have a rubber grommet deep inside and that's what's going to hold onto the spark plug for the removal process. Slide that right onto that spark plug. We'll turn this counterclockwise to remove it. There it is, friend. Let's have a quick peek inside this area to confirm there's no miscellaneous debris. Now we can prepare to install our brand new spark plug. Before we install this into the engine, you need to compare your new to your original spark plugs. The area that you want to pay attention to is the threaded portion and the ground strap at the far end there. Make sure everything's the same length. Get that spark plug into our spark plug socket. We'll slowly lower this in. You don't want to drop it. We don't want to cause any damage. Start this in by hand, bottom it out, and then torque this to 16 foot pounds. We'll just double check that real quick. Okay, now it's time to install our ignition coil. We'll have a look down along the area that goes onto the spark plug. It's a good idea to use a small amount of dielectric lubricant in this area. Slide this right down on there. We can install our mounting bolt. For this, we're going to snug it. The torque for it is four foot pounds. Continue on with your electrical connector. We'll press that in, listen for our click, a light tug, lock it down. Once you've completed that one, the process is the same for all others. One last quick inspection in this area and we'll reinstall our engine cover. When installing the cover, we want to make sure that it sits over all four of the mounting points. Give it a wiggle, make sure it's secured in place. Okay friend, we finished our installation. The next thing you need to do is hop in the passenger compartment, start up the vehicle, let it run for a while, make sure you have no check engine light, no misfire, and take your vehicle for a road test. Thanks for watching. 
when only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.